this is question number 10 of exercise number 2.1 statement of the question is show that the roots of this equation are real if we want to show that the roots of this equation are real we have to prove that the discriminant of this equation is positive we know very well that discriminant is b square minus 4 a c now here a is equal to b minus c as coefficient of x square is b minus c b is equal to c minus a as coefficient of x is c minus a c is equal to a minus b as the constant term is a minus b now discriminant is b square minus 4 a c we have to put the values c minus a whole square minus 4 into b minus c into a minus b by a minus b whole square identity we will open this c square plus a square minus 2 a c minus 4 we will multiply these two brackets a b minus b square minus a c plus b c when we open these brackets c square plus a square minus 2 a c minus 4 a b plus 4 b square plus 4 a c minus 4 b c these are seven values first of all we will see is there any like term here like term is minus 2 a c and plus 4 a c we will add these two terms then we will get first of all we will write a square plus c square plus 4 b square I have written perfect squares first a square plus c square plus 4 b square now minus 4 a b minus 4 b c minus 4 a b minus 4 b c and when we will add these two terms we will get plus 2 a c these are 6 values 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So, we will apply A plus B plus C whole square formula. A plus B plus C whole square is equal to A square plus B square plus C square plus 2AB plus 2BC plus 2CA. We have to apply this formula. So, we will make this expression as the right hand side this is a square this is 2b whole square and this is c square now a square plus b square plus c square then we have 2ab means 2 into a into 2b which is 4ab but we have minus 4ab it means either a is negative or 2b is negative we will check it plus 2 into b is 2b and c is c here we will get 4bc which is also negative as 4ab is negative and 4bc is negative and b is common in these two so this value is negative now we will get minus 4ab minus 4bc plus 2 into c into a we will get 2ac now this is a square plus b square plus c square plus 2ab which is minus 4ab written here minus 4bc which is written here and plus 2ac which is written here so it is in the form of a square plus b square plus c square plus 2ab plus 2bc plus 2ca which is equal to a plus b plus c whole square so it will be written as a minus 2b plus c whole square and perfect square is always positive so it is greater than 0 now we will write the statement as discriminant is greater than 0 so roots will be real it is proved